Hey everybody, Kathy here with Pain Point by Kathleen Miller. How is everybody today? I'm in a pretty good mood. Um, I'm here previewing a couple new colors from uh, Sherwin-Williams. I went on this weekend and thought, oh, I'm going to go in there and see what they have new. So this color, it's called um, Whole Wheat, kind of like cereal, you know what I mean? And um, it's a real pretty light beigey color. Uh, I got it from the back. If you turn the little uh, turn cells that they have there, it gives you all of like some colors that are really, really popular. So I thought, why not try this? So this is a 12 by 12 inch gessoed board. And all that is, it's a board gessoed, ready to go. You do not have to prime it with anything. It is just like it is. Bring it home, take the covering off, and away you go. So this um, I did say a 12 by 12, but I want to also say there is no water, there's no silicone, there's no glue in my base paint. My base paint is always wet. It is not dried. Wet. Just remember, your base is wet. My colors I have is Amsterdam Primary Cyan. This is Mango Mamba and Marigold from Color Art that I combined together. Liquitex Brilliant Purple. This is Rhapsody Rose by Color Art Primary Elements. Lime Squeeze and Mermaid Scales. I also incorporated primary elements. This is Greek Isle, Color Art Primary Elements. Quinacridone Magenta by Golden. These are Boysenberry Primary Elements. This is Maple Leaf Green by Artist Loft. And that is 24 Karat Gold by Defoir. And I, I'm gonna add a little bit of my Albergine. I hardly have any left, but I can't leave her out. But I went into my stash and uh, got some new colors to show you from the primary element uh, section that I have here. And uh, I haven't used some of them in quite a while, and I know all the newbies have not seen them. Um, my old standbys, I'm sure you're familiar with them, but I just wanted to bring in some new colors. Okay, so here we go. I don't want to touch this. You mentioned that, of course, you're using some of the color art colors you haven't used in a while, and you can get a nice 20% discount by using Kathy's code, Kathy Miller 520 and you get a 20% discount of anything you purchase through color art. There's a direct link to the color art site in the description box. Take advantage of that. They have wonderful products. Save yourself some money. And if you notice my colors, I don't mix up a lot in my containers because I... Maybe I can kind of show you. These I are, um, like yeah. mixing them up pretty fresh. Like they last, but I prefer not to mix up like a whole big container of one paint. And these are what, 3.5 well, uh, um, ounce cups? Yes. And yeah, Kathy does enough for just a couple paintings. Because she likes to have her paints and her cell activator as fresh as possible. Yeah, so that's why I'm making paints all the time because I don't make a large amount. I mean, you can if you'd like, but that's just not my gig. And speaking of making paints, all these paints do have the same recipe for their pouring medium. That's in video 478. It's Kathy's secret recipe video. There's a direct link in the description box to get to that video very quickly. Yeah, whenever Phil says it's a secret, I always I always have to start laughing because it's just not a secret anymore. <laughs> that's such okay. an easy recipe. Yeah, it is. So tomorrow, guess what we're going to be doing, Phil? Making paints. That's what I was afraid of. But um, the, the fun part about making these paints because I don't make a, a large amount is I like to go and just I'm very very colorful I like to go into my stash and pull out some new ones so everybody can see some new colors and, and there's a lot of colors that I have not used in ages so that's my one of my reasons why I like to make new ones and you like to combine more than one color together I love to combine because if you don't like like a bright pink, just add a little darker color to it. Or if you want, you know, a real light one, what I do is I go in and I take my Milky Way 
which is from white. Pri from primary elements, and I incorporate in there. That will give you such a uh, shine and sparkle. It's absolutely beautiful. Well, the beauty of Kathy's recipes uh, is that you can use them for two paints. You can use them for acrylic fluid acrylics and pigments. pigments. A combination of those. You don't have to have uh, just two paint or pigment. You can actually put some pigments with two paints and vice versa. And the recipe works just fine. And even like on your cell activator, you can use the paints for your colored cell activator. I'm one that likes to stick to my black. That's just my preference. But I've used uh, a lot of different colors in the past for my cell activators. And not just two paints, you've used other well you can it's your choice whatever you really like i like the two paints i, I know i know you do but that's just me you've used pigments though also i've used pigments i think uh the two paints work better but that's just my yes. opinion uh, so now what we're going to do is ah we're going to take our cell activator which is oxide black an australian floetrol and a lot of, uh, not a lot, but some people have been, some newbies, is American Floetrol as good as Aussie. That's controversial. I prefer the Australian. There's nothing wrong with the American. It's your choice. The Australian Floetrol is very expensive, but that's what works best for me. American might work best for you. So that's your opinion. I'm not going to say one is better than the other. So... With that said, now you have the answer. <laughs> Might not be the answer they're looking for, though. No. But that's just my opinion. I'm going to, uh, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this in two parts. Yes. Swipe one half and then swipe the other. Okay. I got to go like this. Otherwise, I'm going to hit my arm. And my puppy pool was nice and clean. You actually cleaned it this morning. Not <laughs> but anymore. Look at it already. Yeah. It's not. But that's okay. There is a specialty video in the description box on how Kathy does her puppy pool and spinner setup. And as I said, there's a direct link. You can go in there. Go right to her video. Were you whispering on that last word? Video. <laughs> no, but um, okay. We're getting some pretty nice colored cells up. Let that perk a little bit. Let it come up while I cover this. And I forgot to use my aubergine fill. Oh, yes, she's going to be yelling at me. I only had just a little bit left anyway, so it was like, uh, I'll have to make more of her tomorrow. Kathy does have a Facebook group called Paint Party by Kathy Miller. She'd love to have you join. The neat thing about that is you can post your own creations, which is really cool. Uh, ask questions, make comments. There's many wonderful artists using different techniques that post in Kathy's Facebook group. There's a direct link to get uh, to become a member of Kathy's Facebook group in the description box. And also there's a direct link to subscribe to Kathy's YouTube channel by the same name, Paint Boring by Kathleen Miller. It has over 700 videos along with discount links in the description box, specialty videos, and other information. So hop over there, too. I'm just dabbing up some of this cell activator. Mm -hmm. So I hope everybody's having a great day today. I know I am. So far, so good. Nothing's going wrong. 
There's always something happening to Phil and I. You never know. We have a good day, then we find out that our water's running somewhere. Oh my goodness. That's okay. <laughs> we want me to tell the story about the water. Oh, that was... Uh, our, our water bill is normally, I don't know, 30 or $40 a month. Well, yesterday we get a, an email from the water company saying our next bill is going to be $648. We're thinking, what the heck is going on here? And uh, so I, of course, give them a call and, and they said, well, you're using 300 and some gallons an hour. 377 gallons an hour. I'm thinking, that's, that's impossible. We don't, we, it's just us. Nothing has changed. Well... <laughs> Come to find out that there's a water leak down by the valve. Our house is on a hill, and the valve is down by the road, so of course we never noticed any water okay. leaking in our yard. Okay, so we're going to move on Okay. from the water thing. So I'm going to use my catalyst tool. Oh, okay. I wonder no. if I should Show the catalyst tool, I wonder please. if I should spin this a little bit more. This is a number two. It's a number two catalyst tool. Okay. Uh, maybe I will. Just a little bit. Okay. I'm liking this base color. It's really pretty. It is. It shows very, up very the, pretty. the swipe very nicely. Okay. So here we go. Okay. Oh, I love that. That's really pretty. Oh, that's neat. That is neat. Yeah, you picked up so many cool colors there. I don't know how I'm going to wash this with no water. <laughs> well, well, they just kind of finished the story real quick. We have to had to turn the water off at the veil, which means we have absolutely no water for cooking or drinking or whatever, unless I run down to the road, turn it on for a while. Uh, Kathy can wash her hair, I can take a shower, then go run down there and turn it back off. Good thing, because we'd be pretty stinky. <laughs> so, and today is Wednesday, and the soonest they can come out to fix it is Friday. So we've got a few more days of fun. Wow, That's this really is getting cool. so cool. That is really cool. Very, very cool. I don't think I want to do any more. Well, I might bring some of this over here. No, if I, well, well, here's my unsolicited advice. If I was going to do anything be here. That, that bigger saw, but I, I don't know. I mean, it's you, you got to, you know, see what your eye tells you. Oh yeah, cool, very cool. That's what my eye was I, telling me. I think this is fabulous. It right really is, head. I wow. love this. Okay. There okay. you go. No, have it, there we go. Oh. Wow, this is really, really cool. Those catalyst tools They're can really, neat. really create some super effects. You've left a nice coloration of the central swipe. I'm loving this top with all these colors and cells. So pretty. Yeah, that is so cool. Kind of go down the line here. So everyone, if you like my creation, give me a thumbs up, share it with your friends. Um, get yourself some catalyst tools. They're in my Amazon shop. They're a lot of fun. And you can make a whole bunch of different designs with them. That's what's so fun. So until the next time, everybody. Have a great day. Stay healthy. Stay safe. We'll see y'all later, alligators. Bye. Can you turn it?